to story time with me, Miss Sheila. I hope you're having a wonderful and beautiful day. Today's story is called Being You. Oh, let's get into it. This story is about you and the way your eyes will shower light to open a path through the noisy night. And tonight you'll hear sounds because I'm out on my balcony. So you hear people walking and playing and stuff like that. You are a million years old and as tall as a mountain and fast as a river water. A dancer, a singer in charge of the game. The rule maker. Yeah, that's you. The rule maker. And look at how high she is on that swing. That's pretty high. But in this world, there are whispers that move through the air like paper planes or fallen leaves. They swirl around you. Sometimes they tell you who you are, but only you and love decide. Mm -hmm. You might think there is nowhere safe, but there is. The sound of this voice or the curl of this smile might for a moment chase fear away. See the little boy there? Watch a bird soar and think, me too. When choice arrives at your door, like a relative you love, believe it came to give you a hug. Ooh. Ooh, look at her, grooving away. Nobody wants to be invisible. A body wants to be full and fluid. It wants to dance and slouch. It wants to see you nod and smile before it collapses on the couch. If there was a sign on your chest, what would it say? If it told your story, if it said you, who you were, would it say, here is the happiest, bravest, strongest, most complicated child who wishes someone could read this sign? Hmm. This little guy right here looks kind of upset. I wonder why. Oh. And this girl is not listening to these two. It looks like they might be talking negative or drama. Don't need no drama here. <laughs> Would it say, I'm not who you think I am? Mm. This one says, I am powerful. I am smart. I am strong. I am capable. And I am talented. And this one says, I am. So feel out what you are. Are you lovable? Yes, you are. It might say, if you look deeper past my disguise, you might see me past my shadowed eagle. Mm. Oh, shadowed eyes, sorry. They might say you are tough. Don't take no stuff. But how far can you go on tough before that it's nothing else? Sometimes it's not the one you expected who can see you sitting there wondering. When the sky will blue. Mm. So that's them. But the teacher is seeing. Who sees through the noise and the trouble? Who can see you? It might just be a smile that frightens the clouds, leaving you there. Better and still you. And I think it's the teacher because she's smiling at them and it looks like they have, um, they're looking happier and they're leaving. So I hope you enjoyed this story and I hope you remember that you're important and that this story is about you. And if you were a sign, what would it say? If it said you were, if it said who you were, who would you be? The story is yours to tell and share it to the world because you are very, very important. Until next time with me, Michelle, keep shining your light bright. Bye for now.